I am a bunny. Hi friends, Miss Emily here today. I'm going to read you, I am a bunny. I am a bunny. I am a bunny. My name is Nicholas. I live in a hollow tree. Here's Nicholas, and here's his hollow tree that he lives in. In the spring, I like to pick flowers. I chase the butterflies and the butterflies chase me. In the summer, I like to lie in the sun and watch the birds. And I like to watch the frogs in the pond. When it rains, I keep dry under a toadstool. It's a kind of mushroom. I blow the dandelion seeds into the air. In the fall, I like to watch the leaves falling from the trees. I watch the animals getting ready for winter. And when winter comes, I watch the snow falling from the sky. Then I curl up in my hollow tree and dream about spring. So one of my favorite pages in I Am a Bunny is the page where he says he likes to listen to the birds in the summertime. Let's see if I can find it. Here it is. He says, in the summer, I like to lie in the sun and watch the birds. So watching birds is something that I think a lot of us have been doing while we've been at home and away from school right now. So I wanted to share with you um, some flashcards that I have. These are matching cards and you're supposed to match the birds that go together. But I just want to show you some of the different types of birds there are because there are a lot of types of, there are many types of birds in the world and we see a lot of them right outside our window. But um, let me see what kind of birds I have on these cards that I could show you. So this one is called an ostrich. It has a long neck, long legs, and lots of big feathers. This is a big bird. Ostriches are large. Here's one you may be familiar with because we have a lot of these in Rhode Island. This is a swan. This is called a mute swan. They're white with orange beaks and black feet. And there's a little bit of black around their face. Sometimes we see these um, down at the water if we walk down towards the water when we're at school. Here's a noisy one. This is a red-headed woodpecker. Do you know what they do? They peck, they knock holes into the trees. Sometimes you can hear them pecking at the trees. And the reason they're doing that is because they're making a hole in the tree to get bugs out that they're gonna eat because they think bugs are yummy. This is called a magnificent bird of paradise. I don't, I don't know that I've ever seen one of these in person, but they are beautiful. This is a Eurasian blackbird. We see a lot of blackbird type birds around. We see crows and ravens. Here's one you might see at the aquarium, an Atlantic puffin. Hmm, that's pretty cool. Puffin. A fun word to say. House sparrow. We have a lot of sparrows here in Rhode Island. I see these outside my window quite a bit. Wild turkey. Um, I know that my friend Asher has some turkey feathers at his house. These are very big birds also, and you may see these. Sometimes maybe if you're driving in the car, you might see them on the side of the road walking around. They like to walk around in big groups, and they're not really afraid of humans, which can be a little scary for us because they're, they're very big in person. Blue jay. This is one of my favorites. 
There are a lot of these in the trees outside our windows. Um, the boys are this beautiful blue color. The girls are not quite so blue, but they're still really lovely. I like those. Laughing Kookaburra. That's a funny name, right? There's a song about a kookaburra we sing at school. Emperor Penguin. Do you remember where penguins like to live? Yeah, where it's kind of chilly. Mm -hmm. Golden Pheasant. Look at the tail on the pheasant. Those are very long feathers. Mm. Another one of my favorites, the barn owl. We all know what the owl says, right? Ooh, ooh. and has it has those big round eyes owls really only come out at night that's why we don't really see them so much because at night we're sleeping flamingo you see these at the zoo okay one more this is a certain kind of duck called a mallard I've seen these near us also with the green head, and you see the little bit of blue feathers peeking out from underneath the white part of the, of the wing, a mallard. So those are some of the different kinds of birds in the world, and there are so many different kinds. If you see an interesting type of bird outside your window, you could take a picture and send it to us, and then we would all be able to see the bird that you have at your house.